Hello everyone, this is Silverhawkscape with my first facts video. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe the video and hit the notification bell button. With that out of the way, let's begin. Here are some 5 quick facts about the spunky lawyer from Liwei. Fact number 1, Pyrocatalyst. With the release of Yanfei in the highly anticipated patch 1.5 release, Yanfei is a legal advisor of great fame from Liwei and a pyrocatalyst wielder. Yanfei's assaults are said to accompany her custom terms and conditions, sentencing her foes to torment and demise. Everything about Yanfei deals AOA pyro damage, making her a good secondary elemental DPS. Her abilities give her Scarlet Seal that stack up to 3 times. These reduce Yanfei's stamina consumption and increase her charge attack damage, during which all Scarlet Seals are consumed. Fact number 2 Half Illuminated Beast. Yanfei has the blended blood of an illuminated beast, making Yanfei a half human and half adept type, and the second such character after Ganyu, everyone's favorite Coco Goat. We know from leaked voice lines from Honey Hunter that her father is an adept type, leading to the conclusion that her mother was a mortal human. This leads to fact number three. Fact number three No contract with Lex Lapis. Yanfei was born during a time of peace and so never had to make a contract with the Geo Archon Lex Lapis. As such, she doesn't have to concern herself with adeptal affairs, giving her the freedom to focus on the life she wants to live, in this case being the best lawyer in Liwei. Fact number 4, Civil Case Dread While Yanfei is the best lawyer of Liwei, she does have cases she dreads to handle. In her words, Civil cases are the ones I dread the most. Divorces, custody disputes. It's a thankless task trying to unpack these kinds of cases with logic and reason. You have to be kind, courteous, and patient with your clients, even though half the time they are completely incapable of participating in a constructive discussion. I know I advertise myself as being fully versed in every area of the law, but honestly, if it were up to me, I'd rather everyone could just get along so... We wouldn't have so many of these cases. Fact number 5. Cross-Region Friendship Yanfei has had a close correspondence with the upcoming Spindrift Knight, Eula Lawrence, ever since the latter saved her life from the contents of a dangerous cargo from the Abyss Order. Yanfei at the time was a consultant from the merchant vessel when she decided to investigate the cargo in question. According to Eula, had she and her company arrived a few minutes later, Yanfei may not have been so fortunate. Likewise, the Spindrift Knight says Yanfei owes her a favor, one where she needs Yanfei's assistance in tracking someone down. Bonus Fact Career Backup While Yanfei is the best legal advisor of Li Wei, she has a dream in the far future where, in her view, the law will have entered into people's hearts. All people will be amiable, modest, and live happily in this world. The halls of judgment will be empty and the mountains of legality shall be caked in years of dust. Though this may sound like something very far off, for someone like Yanfei, who is half a deaf type, she will most likely see this world where her services will no longer be required. With this thought and encountering one of Xinya's performances, Yanfei came to what she considered to be a decent backup plan. For someone who can recite tens of thousands of words worth of leeway law from front to back within an hour, speed at least should be of no challenge. If such a day were to arrive, she would just become a rapper. Only one who plays it in Leeward Harbor. 
been thinking about staging concerts elsewhere lately, but, yeah. What say you sign me up for your world tour? Anywhere's good. Almost about to go live over here. You coming? about. I'm on fire lately. Look out for my next performance. <laughs>